Hey friends, welcome to another exciting unboxing video. This is uh, the second in the series of the uh, four hour collection. Took uh, the drive out to get a few, um, two weeks ago. Um, got a little sidetracked last week. Uh, I had another collection come up, uh, probably one of the largest collections I've ever purchased. It filled a nine foot U-Haul, top to bottom. Um, I posted a picture or two on my uh, Facebook page, just showing the, the filled up U-Haul uh, van. And it is massive. I mean, it's over a hundred boxes of stuff like this, just packed. Um, I don't even know what all's in it. It was uh, kind of segmented, but I basically, looked at pictures that had a, a shot of what was in each box from the top. So if you saw some spines, great. And otherwise it was just what was facing up. So I took a guess and basically colored it out. We came to a deal and drove up, picked it up, brought it back. Uh, it's in storage. Um, I'm gonna work through this collection now and then I will just slowly start working through that one. There is gonna be no rhyme or reason to it. It is taking up a storage unit by itself. So it's going to be a lot of fun going through it. Basically, a massive collector. Uh, books from the, uh, I'd say, early 80s most likely up until the mid-2000s. So um, everything from uh, Chaosium stuff. I saw a lot of FASA stuff. I saw some T TSR, um, Alderac. I mean, everything. There was just, if there was a system going on, a lot of small press, um, some rare items, some good stuff. It's going to be fun to go through. All right, this box is uh, got some neat, good stuff in it. Um, all kinds of things in here. So let's just get to it. We've got Hero System. This is the unrevised, unfortunately. Uh, fifth edition core book. Uh, the Second World Source book. Small press D20. Who did this? Second World no, Publications. Um, all Flesh Must Be Eaten. This is the uh, original edition, not the revised. A couple Palladium books. Uh, this is currently out of print. This is the book of a compendium of contemporary weapons. In pretty good shape. This needs a little bit wiped down, a little dusty. And then another one that's currently out of print, the compendium of weapons, armor, and castles. Uh, more medieval stuff, and this one's in great shape. Basically brand new. Got a uh, Warhammer, I think this is 4th edition hardcover. Um, probably end up just throwing it on eBay because I don't really sell a lot of Warhammer in my website. A couple D&D books here. This is uh, Tome of Magic, soft cover. And then the DMGR3 Arms and Equipment Guide. Nice shape. That's it for... D&D in here, two Star Wars books. We've got the Rebellion Era source book. This is for the D20 Star Wars. And then the Dark Side source book. Both of those are in really nice shape. A couple of D20 modern items. We've got the Core Rule book. Nice shape. The Urban Arcana campaign setting. And the D20 Menace Manual. All three of those are in great shape. Cool uh, book from Eden. We've got Army of Darkness based on the movie, the classic movie. Uh, Warhammer Magic, it's just a source book. I think that was part of a box set. Uh, this is kind of a cool item from Fantasy Flight. This is Mechamorphosis. Uh, this is a D20. Light Horizon gaming system. That's obviously the Transformers uh, mecha game. The Stingy Gamer uh, edition of Silver Age Sentinels. A uh, whole bunch of... Uh, well, actually, no. no There's a Dragon Age uh, Quick Start Rules. I think this was a free RPGA mod book way back when. This is an early D20 item. This is Vigilance. This is a superhero uh, setting. Got Silver Age Sentinel screen. Let's see, all kinds of random things. This is an, one of Mongoose's Encyclopedia Arcane. This is the Dragon Magic source book. 
don't think I get that one in very often. Uh, early D20 is his Unearth Arcana Unearthed Counter Collection. Just uh, kind of this collection number four, see if that matters to anybody. Uh, time of War Quick Start Rules from Battletech. I actually never knew that they did this. And then flip over and it's a shadow run. That's cool. I don't know what year that was. Let's see if it has a date in here. No, nothing I see on it. But based on the artwork, I'd say 2010-ish. All right, looks like another batch of D20 free RPG items. This is uh, Black Hour Run, Black Arrow Run. Uh, this is the Game Master Mo Game Mastery Module D0, La Hollow's Last Hope from Paizo. Uh, it's part of the Game. Ma uh, this is the Game Master screen for mutants and masterminds with the outer card. Another Dragon Age. Shadows Fell, Temple of Orcus. Uh, another Pathfinder module. I don't know if this is a free RPG. What? No, yeah, it was. Dawn of the Scarlet Sun. And then We Be Goblins 2, which I've had that one a couple of times. It seems to be in demand. The Factory Source Book for D20. It's kind of a cool book. This is a rarity. This is the Armageddon uh, role-playing game. The End Times Are Here by Myrmidon Press. Uh, later reprinted by uh, a second edition, I think, by Eden Publishing. But this is the original edition by uh, Myrmidon Press. Uh, D20 Modern. GM Screen. Uh, GURPS Light. Uh, this is Todd Gamble's Carta Cartographica uh, module, um, journal maps, which was a pretty cool D20 supplement from Green Ronin. This is interesting. This is the Boxed Nightmares uh, module with the, the additional uh, newspaper that it came with which is often gone and is not part of the current reprint that they did. I mean, I think they incorporated it into the thing, but in this version, the original version, you got a little fake newspaper clipping. clipping. And um, it was um, kind of cool. Just a neat little thing there. Shadowrun, this is the third edition core book. And then our last... Uh, item is the Spycraft Modern Arms Guide from Alderac. So, a very a varied box of stuff. Uh, a lot of good things in here. A lot of social things in here, but uh, still fun to go through. Uh, I like it when it's kind of all over the place. Because it helps fill out the website a little easier. Um, hope you saw something you liked, and I will see you on the next one. Thanks.